Right. Hi everyone and welcome back to Make It At Home. We are in fall 2021. This is the first of our fall season. Today you can pick up a friendship bracelet pack from the AS. Uh, if you don't make it in today, come and get it soon while supplies last. So this is a simple craft. It's fun. It's easy. It's a little time consuming, but uh, I really enjoyed it. In your packet, you obviously have your directions on the outside and the inside. You've got your cardboard with eight different colors of embroidery floss, and they're all th about 30 inches, give or take a half an inch or so, um, because I am not a machine, and I hand cut these all myself. So you've got eight colors to choose from, and then you also have some masking tape for securing your bracelet as you make it. You will also need to provide your own scissors, and that's just for cutting the excess um, floss at the end. Alright, so, just to give you an idea, this is the final product of the pattern that is included. You can obviously look at patterns on your own, but this was a simple one that I thought everybody would be able to make. It's a four color bracelet. There you go. So, um, to start with, I want to talk about the knot that you're going to be using. It's called a forward knot, and it's pretty easy. So, you're going to pick four colors. And you want to unwrap it the way that I loaded it, not the way that I just tried to do it. So we'll do orange, we'll do green, we'll do blue. and black. Alright, so you're going to take those four strands and line them up evenly at one end. And you're going to knot them all together and leave about a half an inch of floss at the end. And then you're going to take the tape that's on the bottom and you're going to secure it to a flat surface. and separate the four strands so that they're apart. So the forward knot is you're going to start with your leftmost strand and you're going to fold it like this so it looks like a four with this first strand and you take your four and you loop it under the second strand and you just pull it tight. And you're going to do that twice on each strand. So two, and then you pick up your next strand One, two, and then the fourth strand. One, two, and you 
want to make sure you pull it tight. And that's it. And you just keep doing that with each strand. So we'll go black to green. Then black to orange. Black to blue. And then green to orange, green to blue, green to black. And eventually you'll end up back where blue is at the beginning. So in this completed one, you can see. So I started with purple, then orange, blue, then red. Purple, orange, blue, red. So you'll get four colors at a diagonal. Now the opposite of a forward knot is a backward knot. And so you can see on this one, I started with the forward knot and then I switched to a backward knot. And the backward knot is the same, but backwards as a forward knot. So you take your rightmost and you make a backwards four. And then you take the strand next to that and you loop it over and under and tie it twice. and continue to the left. So forward moves from left to right, backward moves from right to left. And you keep making that uh, until it's a comfortable length to fit around your wrist. Then you tie the end, and then you tie it around your wrist and cut off the excess. So this one that I'm wearing on my wrist is actually eight strands of four colors. So two of each color, and you line it up four and four, and you, when you get to the middle of doing forward knots, you switch and do backward knots. Again, it's something that you can look up online if that's something that you're interested in, because you do have eight colors provided with you in your packet. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this and have some fun, and you can either keep it or give it to a friend, and if you decide to use all of your floss you can wind up with two bracelets all right don't forget to pick up your kit in the as thanks for watching